He's a 28-year-old Scotsman, green to the ways of Hollywood, and not quite used to the frenzied attention that comes with movie stardom. The fact that I've been nominated with the kind of company that I've been nominated in is incredible. I mean, that's the thing that I wasn't prepared for. Peter, here we go. Roll video. This year, he stars in Atonement, the period drama from Focus Features, which is owned by NBC Universal. In it, McAvoy gives his most critically acclaimed performance so far. Atonement was the best script I've ever read. Thanks. Take the flowers. I'm all right. Take the flowers. I'm all right. He plays Robbie Turner, the son of a housekeeper, oh. at the stately home of the Tallises, a wealthy English family. It seems to be an excellent example of one of the most popular stories. A human being destroyed for an unjust reason. I love you. And that, to me, spoke hugely. Why are you crying? Don't you know? One hot summer night, Turner is caught in a steamy embrace with the household's eldest daughter, Cecilia, played by Kira Knightley. Cecilia! In time, the two lovers are torn apart by a child's vicious accusation and a world at war. I was absolutely devastated by that character, uh, and I carry him with me to this day. I, I find it very hard to not get angry about what happens to him. McAvoy found an instant rapport with Knightley, who was also nominated for a Golden Globe for her performance. We very quickly discovered that we had each other's back, so to speak. And then from that, you can take risks and you can open to each other, and that means that you can have chemistry. He was equally struck by the 22-year-old's poise and professionalism. I hope this buzz never comes. Kira, she's got a lot of pressure on her shoulders, you know, because she's, she's one of the biggest stars in the world, I'd say. And I think she deals with it exceptionally well. I was very impressed by her. On top of all that, as an actress, she knocked my socks off. McAvoy's humble upbringing in Glasgow, Scotland, prepared him well for the working class role of Robbie Turner. But before he decided to pursue acting, he actually thought he heard a higher calling. Yes, I did consider joining the priesthood at one point. I was very young, and I considered it for a very short length of time. <laughs> Round about the same time as I was considering becoming a priest, I also had my first taste of, of women. And that kind of blew the priesthood <laughs> out of the water. Now married to British actress Anne-Marie Duff, McAvoy has been acquiring his own fan base stateside, much to his surprise. I've probably spent about six weeks in Hollywood in my entire life, I think. Um, so it's strange when people call you an upcoming Hollywood whatever, you know. But there's little doubt in Hollywood that McAvoy is becoming one of the most wanted new stars. Sorry? In fact, this summer he graduates to action hero status in the new thriller, Wanted, alongside the sexiest of co-stars, Angelina Jolie. Through it all, James McAvoy is aiming high, but keeping his head above the hype. It's been a very, very steady thing. It's not happened overnight for me, so I haven't just suddenly gone, wow, how did this all happen, you know? Um, but don't get me wrong, I'm incredibly, incredibly grateful and slightly shocked that it's happened at all.